Hello again. Today we're going to learn an exercise called the rolling up. This is a very special kind of sit-up, the Pilates sit-up. It's unlike anything you've ever learned before. And the trick of this is that you've got to be disciplined. You've got to try to do it and keep doing it the way I'm teaching you because it's strengthening inner abdominals. If you resort to the crunch that we all know how to do, then you're simply building strength in the outer abs, which we all have strength there already, and you're neglecting the strengthening, strengthening of the inner abs. Now, that's not to say that the outer abs are bad, but when you strengthen the inner abs and they're working together, your strength is, is tremendous, your balance is tremendous, and also you don't have to use the outer abs so much. Therefore, you don't need to carry around so much bulk. And as we get older, this is a particularly important point for us. So I'm going to show you once again the goal where we're headed eventually with this exercise, and then I'm going to show you how to get there. So let's start with taking a look at what it is supposed to look like. So my arms are over my head. I'm going to flex my feet. I'm going to inhale as I roll up my spine. I'm going to exhale as I come up and stretch long, oh, nice. And I'm going to point my feet as I inhale and exhale as I roll down my spine with control. All right, now I'm going to teach you how to get there. So we're going to start with our knees up. And I'm going to raise my arms over my head and I'm going to roll up my spine. Now, when you begin to do this, your spine is not going to feel like it's rounded at all. It's going to feel like a lot of flat spots on it. And that's okay. That's where we all start. So be patient with yourself. But try to get more and more roundness every time you do this because that's creating more flexibility. That's creating more roundness in your back. So I'm going to raise my arms. I'm going to sequentially start at the top of my spine and roll up and you're going to get stuck about here. Now when you get stuck, grab onto your hamstrings or your clothing, whatever you need to, and keep that back rounded as you come up. Okay? The roundedness of the back is crucial to keeping the inner abs activated and letting go of the outer abs. Okay? Same thing when you come back. Inhaling as you roll down with control, holding on until you can let go and do it on your own. Okay, let's do that one more time. Knees are up, and I'm going to lift my arms. I'm going to start at the top of my spine. Shoulder blades, I'm stuck here, so I'm going to grab on and continue to roll up. Continue to use the inner abs, not the outer abs. Coming all the way up, and then reverse it. See if you can roll down the spine, starting at the base of the spine. And when you can let go, do so, rolling down the rest of your spine. Good. Great. See you in the next video where we're going to learn a couple of new exercises called rolling and the seal.